Finding God's Peace During a Sleepless Night by Carissa Moore You will keep in perfect peace those whose minds are steadfast because they trust in you. Isaiah chapter 26 verse 3 It is now 1.51 in the morning and I have given up on sleep. So I came downstairs to meditate on scripture and pray, my go-to habit when I can't sleep. The time has been sweet, refreshing my spirit, and reveals so much about myself and God. The Lord prompted me to share with you, step by step, as it is happening, what my time looks like. I start with Isaiah chapter 26. Here are the items I need to do this. A Bible, writing utensils like a highlighter and pen, online commentary, and a journal. The steps I take are, read through the first time without notes, highlight verses that stood out to me, write out thoughts or questions in margins. This can be done in a journal as well. I look up parts I don't understand, look for context words, lots of battle terms. I pray for understanding throughout for myself and for you. I pray for rest. Perfect peace equals perfect trust. What I learn about God and myself in each verse. God's character, my character. Our salvation, strong city. Open gates, faithful. Keeps in peace, steadfast mind. Rock eternal, trust the Lord forever. Humbles prideful, the oppressed win. Upright, smooth path. His judgment teaches righteousness, student. Worthy of praise, wait, obey, know him. Majesty, experience evil because of God's grace for all mankind. Authority, protected from enemies. Establishes peace, open to his good things. Lord and ruler, honor his name no matter who rules over me. Destroys oppressor, Temporary suffering, glorified through the righteousness, repent and cry out. Disciplines the wicked, I suffer if I do not do what is right or bring salvation to others. Questions for Reflection What does perfect peace mean? Learn more in verse 3. What is the significance of an upraised hand? Read about it in verse 11.